This is the Georgia Emergency Management Agency with your radiological officer briefing for emergency workers. You are being issued dosimetry because of the potential for exposure to radiation. This dosimetry will help ensure that your exposure is recorded in order to keep your dose as low as possible. For female emergency workers, if you are pregnant or think that you could be, you should notify your team leader and consider requesting a new assignment outside of any potentially contaminated zone. Your dosimetry packet includes at least one self-reading dosimeter, one thermoluminescent dosimeter, or TLD, one emergency worker exposure procedure, and one potassium iodide, or KI tablet. The provided potassium iodide, or KI tablets, are to be taken only if and when directed. You should read and understand the medication warning contained in the procedure before taking the tablet. When issued the dosimetry packet, fill out the requested information as instructed within the procedure. The forms to be completed are contained within the procedure. Clip the self-reading dosimeter and TLD dosimeter to the outside of your outermost garment about chest high. The TLD is a device used for a permanent record of your dose. It cannot be read by you in the field. It must be sent to a laboratory to be read. To read the self-reading dosimeter, lift the clip end of the dosimeter up to your eye while pointing the other end toward a strong source of light and read where the line is on the scale. Record this number on the appropriate form in the procedure. This is your initial reading to begin the mission. You should take a reading from your dosimeter every 30 minutes and record the reading on the form in the procedure. If you reach an exposure of 0.2R, which is indicated by each of the hash marks on the scale, notify the radiological officer or your supervisor. During the incident, your turn back limit is 1R. If you should reach an exposure of 1R on your dosimeter, you are authorized to abandon your mission as detailed in the procedure. A briefing is contained within the procedure that, with your understanding and the permission of the radiological officer, will allow you to extend your mission up to a maximum exposure of 5R. Your total exposure limit is 5R. If you have any specific questions about your dosimetry, direct them to your county radiological officer or your supervisor. If you drop the self-reading dosimeter, call the county radiological officer or your supervisor to report it and give the reading on your dosimeter. Potassium iodide or KI tablets are the white tablets in the blister packs. Take only when directed by the radiological officer or your supervisor. Take one tablet by mouth per day until advised to stop by the radiological officer or your supervisor. Record this on the potassium iodide form contained in the procedure. Do not take KI if you have sensitivity to iodine. Side effects may include skin rashes, swelling of lips or tongue, fever, and joint pain. If you do not volunteer to take KI when instructed, report to the radiological officer immediately. More information on KI, including symptoms of an allergic reaction, is contained in the procedure. After your shift, report to an emergency worker decontamination center for monitoring. This location may be found in your dosimetry kit, or you can contact the radiological officer. The dosimetry kit should be returned to the county radiological officer or their designee after completion of the mission and decontamination. If you have any questions or concerns, contact your county radiological officer at any time prior to, during, or after the mission. Thank you.